Hello everyone, in this video I will show you how can you use SliceBit. So right now I'm with Premium Plus and I have unlimited files presentation. I can import custom templates, unlimited custom templates. I can upload custom color fonts and add my logo or my company logo. Let's go right now uh, to present the SliceBit app. So here we have a lot of tabs. I will start first with the brand settings. So here uh, you can add your company logo or your logo. And I will choose this one from here. I will upload it as you can see. You can choose here your color palette if you want to. I will choose this blue. You can see the preview here. I will click on save changes and that's it. Here on custom templates you can um, you can upload your custom templates if you want to i will click here and add this one and right now you uh, will be able to see this custom template when you create the presentation okay i will cancel this because i don't need it and right now let's uh, see what chart generator does here you can create uh, charts so uh, let's train the AI to do a chart for us. Let's say that I want a chart for, I mean, let's say I want a pie chart for the US debt. Of course, this is a broad, I mean, is a general topic. If you want to uh, go as deep as possible, you will need to train it. So as you can see, it was, uh, I mean, it's created a, a chart for me. So I can download it from here and that's it. Right now, let's create a presentation from scratch. I will click here on the create presentation with AI and here we have two options. We can create a presentation from a document and from a topic. I usually create presentation with uh, this option from a topic. I will click here on start now. Here I will uh, choose a topic, let's say I will add a topic, let's say that I want to make a presentation about what is blockchain or what is Bitcoin, sorry. Also here you can train it uh, to, uh, uh, you can train it uh, to do the presentation uh, good or to do it engaging and so on. I want that the presentation to be engaging and to the point okay right now I will click here on the next here we have some general settings for our presentation if when if you want short presentation you can choose this option short and informative one which uh, are up to 12 slides as you can see here if you want longer presentations you will need to choose detailed one or custom one which is up to 200 slides as you can see here for this video I will choose short one here at the language tab we can choose whatever language we want I will I will uh, choose English US here at the tone tab we can choose the tone for our presentation here uh, I mean if I will choose a professional uh, tone AI will build me I mean will add me professional text on our, pre our presentations okay here on the amount of text tab we can choose if we want uh, smaller uh, text or longer text uh, personally I choose concise because it's very very good and here at advanced settings we can add images if, if uh, we want to if not we just need to click here to not add images if uh, we want to add speaker notes which uh, are i mean here ai generate or summarize every slide possible uh, to i mean this uh, this feature is best uh, because if you want to uh, summarize each slide this uh, this feature it will create a summarize for all slides and you can present very very easily so I will uh, click here to add speaker notes. You can add 
or use your logo if you want to if not you just need to click here for this tutorial i will i will use my logo you can use your brand color colors and brand font after that we will need to click here on the next tab and here we will need to choose um, the presentation uh, design so as you can see here it's um, that uh, custom template that i was added uh, two minutes ago so right now let's uh, i don't know let's choose this one click on next and here we can uh, give it uh, other instruction let's say that as you can see here you can uh, you, you can say to him say to it sorry um, to be to the point be to the point engaging and not sound as AI AI okay and uh, here I usually choose these options follow the instructions in the document very closely so I will choose this one and click on next right now um, it will generate our uh, presentation so let's wait a couple of seconds so basically uh, after that we will be able to delete or add another slides or table of contents as you can see here we can uh, we can add another table of contents if we want to so let's say that i want to add another slide conclusions if uh, we don't like this uh, table of contents we can regenerate from here and it will uh, regenerate us another table of contents let's wait a little bit to see the result okay if let's say we want to delete a slide from uh, this presentation we just need to go here at the trash button and click on it and right now let's say that this presentation uh, we want to make it uh, and we will click here on generate let's wait right now a couple of minutes one to two minutes maximum and after that we will be able to uh, to see the presentation okay so right now as you can see here our presentation is done is very very beautiful as you can see you have a lot of good infos so here at this tab if you are clicking here on the notes tab you will be able to see uh, the speaker notes that i was discuss uh, three or two minutes ago so right now you can copy uh, the notes from all slides where you have it past it on a document and after that you can present this presentation very very fast and to the point right now you can add here your logo if you want to and after that you can click on apply and you will see that your logo will appear on every slide as you can see you can choose another template if you want to and right now here you can share it uh, you can share a link to another to other people if you want to but you will need to choose this option anyone can access and after that just copy the link and after that you can download it powerpoint or pdf so for this tutorial i will choose powerpoint let's wait a little bit if i will click on it you will be able to see the presentation as you can see here it is very very beautiful let's check all the slides and right now if i want to present i will go um, i will go here on slideshow and from beginning and i will uh, start to present my presentation so yeah this is the video guys